A warning tonight for dog owners. The dog flu is spreading faster in Connecticut than vets first thought. News 8's Bob Wilson live tonight with more on what you can do to protect your pets. Bob. Yeah, it's a new strain of the canine flu coming through. It's pushing its way into Connecticut. Just like a human flu, you get the symptoms, runny nose, runny eyes, and it can be fatal. Just like in humans, the biggest problem is you can't ask your dog what's wrong, and if it's undiagnosed, it can lead to big problems. Gus is at Veterinary Specialists of Connecticut in West Hartford to get his flu shot. The animal hospital has had many calls. Pet owners concerned as a new strain of the dog flu continues to creep deeper into Connecticut. And we have actually a map up in, in all of our exam rooms that shows that it's in Massachusetts. It's in all of our surrounding states. Um, down in Fairfield County was the first actually diagnosed one in Connecticut. So it's kind of swarming in on us. So we're just trying to be proactive. There have been confirmed cases along the shoreline in Fairfield County, so veterinarians across the state are recommending that you get a vaccine for your pet right now before they start showing signs and symptoms of the flu. Clinical signs include nasal discharge as well as ocular discharge, which is if they don't feel good, you know, just coughing, things like that. So that's what we are really looking for. And doctors say it's very important to get your pets vaccinated, mainly because if it goes untreated, the flu can be fatal. They can get a really bad upper respiratory infection, which can develop into a pneumonia and just go from there, which is more difficult to treat the further it goes down into the lungs. They've had so many people ask about the flu vaccine. Next month, they will have a special flu clinic just for the dogs. They get a vaccination because they don't know it can or can't turn into the flu. And you, you treat your dogs like you treat your family. They are one of the family, and if you want to know more about that flu clinic or some more tips or what to look for, or signs and symptoms, you go to WTNH.com, and we'll link you to their site. I'm Bob Wilson reporting live in Hartford, News 8.